Hey guys. E3 2018's Days Gone. The world, this world comes Ooh, to Ooh, February you. 22nd. Did we know that date before? No, they think they just announced it. This was one of their 8 a.m. wake up things to find. Okay, gameplay. Your loser have a run in with RIP the last couple of days? Why? One of my men escaped a ripper camp that tortured him, like they always do. But this time they kept asking me if he knew about it. Two bikers, two men. The ripper called them mongrels. You ask me? You got a price on your head. Someone's here. You know, same as me. Anything that happens here is far better than what's going on out there. Uh oh. I like that there's more going on than just zombies. Perfect. <laughs> just perfect. PlayStation. Man, yeah, so is it open world? It seems like it's... It seems like maybe it's one of those things that's kind of open world, but like, sort of like Last of Us. It like guides you hmm funnels you into things yeah i don't it know it is open world mm. it is what to think of it yet hmm. like i'm excited for I that think one some of the gameplay looked intriguing and i remember with the very very first debut trailer there was a semblance of like his history and past that makes you a little bit interested in his story but Graphically, I feel like they just that 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 trailer, and it would I'd have to look at them side by side, and I don't want to do that right now. But I just in my mind's eye, I feel like that took a small that they've they've stepped us back a bit. Like they're that Tempering maybe they were expectations well, maybe they or... were a little bit aggressive what the game mm. what the game engine would be capable of when they first showed us gameplay, and I feel like it's taken. But I guess what was impressive wasn't the shiny when we first saw it. It was the number of zombies when exactly. they come out, right? So maybe yeah, I'm just remembering it. I was totally just going to bring that up. Maybe I'm just remembering it as wowing me, but it was something else that wowed me. Mm -hmm. The hell? It looks less polished than the original announcement trailer, you think? That's what it feels like to me, to me but... Huh. What the hell? All right. Let's look at this. So this, yeah, this happens every so often, doesn't it? Atlas. Every so often, Persona has like spin-off games. Mm. It's a new, and then they're dancing games. It was a matter of time, wasn't it? <laughs> Wait, am I gonna get spoiled if I watch this? Ooh. Cause I wanna play, I kinda wanna play Persona 5. We can't watch this. I might get spoiled. If I might see something that For I team members, yeah. Okay, I don't want to see it. Fine. Spoiled on characters. We won't watch it. But that's it. Story-wise, nothing. The huh. hell? 15 now we know minutes? I just spent six years with Ryu, chun -Li, and the rest of the Street Fighter 2 cast. But over time, the entire Street Fighter 3 lot In order to enter a power- The fuck? <laughs> 15 so minutes of this guy just- as a shape-shifting... Alright. Is there anything else in PlayStation that we should look at? World of Tanks Mercenaries? Whoa, look at this! I'm bored. <laughs> what else? Anything right. else? There's their Tetris trailer. Dancing in the Moonlight trailer, Days Twin Gone. Mirror, we looked at that. Far Cry 5, Hours of Darkness, launch trailer. What the fuck is this? The fuck is this, guys? Lego DC? Is that on here? 
Maybe we'll do that. I had a good crew. We were brothers. Watch it, they got a 50 caliber down there. It's an ambush! Aboard! Aboard! Play on your fight! We're going down! Play on your fight, reading you loud and clear. This is Firebase Echo. We've got our hands full here. You've got to come to us for extraction. Copy that. I'm coming to you. DLC? This place is infested with outposts and AAA. Watch your back. Looks boring. I heard it wasn't that great, to be honest. <laughs> you have a lot to live up to with... Uh, Blood Dragon? Blood Dragon. Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm not interested. Bore. Wait, what was that little thumbnail? Oh. We're almost bored for a moment. Oh, you didn't like Far Cry 5? Whoa, what? Vampire was launched? What the fuck? All these Rated games, Andrew. what the? Seriously, this came out and nobody's talking about it? Sure. I saw like Evidently it's not that great. Or hunger inside me. It just launched like a week ago. Every night it must be appeased. The thing I've become. It's okay, I like it. A vampire. Average. A thing to be hunted down like an evil beast. What's the gameplay? What is gameplay it like? Gameplay is mass, story is interesting. I know to come. What kind of a game is it though? Getting some good reviews, mixed reviews. Look at this. Like, it looks interesting. Sevens to eights, most outlets. Kind of jank, but fun. You unfortunately, you had to look at the chat, so you missed like every time something interesting came on screen, you were looking away. Aww. Some really weird, cool things kind of showed up there. Choose the lives I now take. Cursed be the choice. RPG hack and slash. Gameplay is rough. Oh, that's too bad because some of the stuff there looked kind of interesting. Enjoyed. One review said I enjoyed it. Vampire. Fifteen things you absolutely need to know. At least they didn't use a red circle and like circle his mole or something. <laughs> it's not the most polished game. It has some issues, but it's fun. Game is rough. Huh. Hmm. Riddled Corpses EX. Oh, this has been in our emails. This looks fun. This yeah. looks cute. <laughs> I actually saved this one for you to look at. I like this. Song. No, it's really cute. <laughs> the like style. Uh huh. And how happy the music is with all this like yeah. <laughs> evil imagery and stuff. I wonder if it's only two player. The Final Fantasy 3 style is like really neat to me, like kind of drawing me in. Yeah. I want. This is my kind of game, looks fun. Is it just two people? Two player? Or is it. it, it yeah, it's two like player it. co op. <laughs> so that's what, that's what those pixelated girls are supposed to look like, just so you know. <laughs> just picture that. Um, uh, is it out? I don't know. Riddled Corpses X launch trailer, so yeah, it is out. That looked like kind of neat. See, it's games like this, like it, what really makes or breaks whether I want to spend time with it is the writing. Mm. Yeah. Because there's there's like there's tons of games out that look like that look really great. Yeah. Like you know look like fun to play. It's kind of a bullet hell game along with a shoot 'em up. That's why I saved it for you to look at. I love bullet hells. But um, yeah, that's the thing is like, if the writing is good, if it, if it makes me laugh, then I'll, I'll, I might want to spend time with it. But if it doesn't, I'll be like, well, I could be spending my time somewhere else yeah. type of thing. Um, we have not seen Death Road to Canada. I do know it has been released, but I haven't seen like much gameplay or anything for it. Hey, look at the, this is the play fearlessly. The, this is, Fear is this? a monster. 
This must be their new slogan for this season. Oh, yeah. Play fearlessly. Here's a monster. The world is full of them. Loneliness. Doubt. But in our world... In our world! They bring darkness. We bring light. We fight free! In our world, we never fear monsters. Here we play. <laughs> That's not... That doesn't look fun. <laughs> what the fuck? That's... N uh, funny. That looked terrifying. <laughs> Did uh, they play that on TV? It seemed like a TV spot. Yeah, it really felt like it. Oh, they wanted that Lego DC supervillain thing. Mm, do you? The streets of Metropolis, but who will save the city now? Citizens, remain calm. Everything is under control. The control of super villains. <laughs> Does it mean, is game. that last little bit supposed to mean basically that's you and you get to make any, yourself into any type of villain you want? Like, oh, I wonder, yeah. create your own super villain. That's what that tells me at the end. Yeah. You get to play as a villain? Maybe. That could be fun. Yeah. You know, that, that's a good example of what I was just mentioning. Like, what matters is the writing and how interested you are in this, this stuff. Like, that's what'll keep you around. And I keep wanting to not be charmed by the Lego. I know, right? Stuff. Because they're just, it's, they just crank it out, right? And, yeah, but and it's also, so well written. It's actually, like, good humor, despite the fact that they are just going for the lowest, <laughs> like, you know, attraction, the fan service. It's just f pure fan service. And yet, it's actually still good writing. Yeah, I don't know how they do that. I would really like Lego City 2, though. I kind of yeah. like that Lego City 2 didn't rely on any property. Mm. It was just a well-written, original property. Lego City, you mean? Yeah, yeah. undercover. Well, besides Lego. Lego City undercover. Yeah, what? Well, that's... Yeah. Receiving hair-raising reports that a gang of henchmen have been unleashed on new urban. So if they got The Incredibles, is this its own game? Is this... What is this? Here's the other thing about, like, there's so much Lego coming out, it's like, you don't even know what belongs to what game. Like, yeah. is that last like thing that we watched with the villains a, an add-on to another game? Is this an add-on? Is this the same game? Is yeah. It, how many games are they, do they have going right now? Yeah, some of them I'm not nearly... But like, These are all their own games? Like, seriously? What? Holy shit. Oh this my is God. a thing? The perfect addition to my collection. Is this its own game as well? I can this is too much. Summon any enemy. Are they not? They're out of control. They have to be stopped. This is ridiculous if this is its own game as well. How are they... It's party. This was part of the Lego your dimensions was as thing. As your mustache, egghead. Okay. Thank okay. Because dimensions was an overall like thing, and then you had different like dimensions. That's what this is then. That I'm not sure. Okay, I don't know. This is. 67 video games, original and licensed since 1995. <laughs> yeah, they're they're fucking. I wonder, wow. I wonder what percentage actual Lego makes up of their their revenue yeah. at this point. How much is video games and is other that things? Is Adventure Time? I heard... Hey, Baldy McNose here! I think that's toast. what's going on. Or, on toast. 
like an egg. Man. So the rating's not always good. Yeah. <laughs> so it, it's hit and miss. It's like it depends on the team. Yeah. Because that, was, that wasn't great. That was a miss team. So sometimes Sorry, it's good. Huh. Um, Bloodstained is out. Mario Tennis. Bloodstained Curse of the Moon is out. Did that just come out today? I'm just seeing. Oh, like, I want to look at no. I want to look at dreams footage. We're gonna cut, and we'll be right back with dreams. Ooh.